loads and loads of composting solutions out there. There's like a little kind of cones that the council provide and they're really nice and you can kind of chuck all your food waste in there and some um, perhaps some waste paper and cardboard and that's just more of a kind of self-contained composting area. You could just pile it all up in a pile and chuck a tarpaulin over it. You don't need to spend hours doing woodwork and making something really fancy. You can make something out of pallets like they've got here. Generally we would try and have a couple of bays because one of the really important things with compost is turning it and then turning it adds lots of air and that's really good for the decomposition and good for the creatures in there. It brings lots of oxygen in and it's kind of increasing the surface area for them to work on and introducing new surface areas for them. So you might have three bays made out of pallets or something, that'd be a really simple version and, and that system's allowing you to move stuff along. We've also got one you kind of spin at our work because one of the ideas is that you want to turn it. Um, so if you kind of would struggle with turning a bay system, this spinny one, we put stuff in it and every time you walk past you can just send it on a spin, it's like on a rack and you just whoop, push it. It's really easy to push and then it means you're not having to do all that physical labour. So there's loads and loads of kind of composting solutions out there, um, but the simplest one is just to pile it all up and turn it occasionally.